now. Whoa, almost fell down the stairs. Show everybody all the snow. Go, go, ready? Ready, Dongcho? Go get the snow. Get it, Dongcho. <laughs> So in today's video, we are going on a good old fashioned toy hunt. Woohoo! I'm so excited. Um, what was I going to say? You know that story or song and it's like, we're going on a bear hunt or something. It's these kids and they're like searching for a bear. But if someone can explain to me that, I've always wondered, well, what are you going to do when you find it? You, you going to kill it? We're stopping into Toys R Us because they have a sale on apparently of Jurassic items. And I want to see if I can maybe get my hands on some stuff and also going to shop stop what's wrong with me saying stop also gonna stop into the showcase store so the showcase store in my mall um it carries you know as seen on tv products and apparently apparently they have boglins there the new boglins so i'm gonna see if i can get my hands on one of the halloween-esque bog boglins there is a bunch of snow outside and uh my driveway is kind of has like you know that big bump that big bump of snow on the outside so hopefully um i can make it over the snow i'm, I'm really bad at driving <laughs> Hey, can I do a cheeseburger with only ketchup, please? And a medium orange pot, please. And that'll be it. Um, I have ketchup, yes, that's right. Yeah, that's fine. Right, that's it, thanks. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't get really far, did I? I didn't have breakfast, so. I kind of deserve this, you know what I'm saying? Okay, time to mask up and... Oh my god, this mask was in my poo pocket. Oh my god. Sometimes I have to put poo in my in my jacket pocket. Like, not, like, obviously it's, you know, in a poo bag, but still kind of, like, smells a little bit. But this mask was in my poo pocket, so this mask actually reeks of poo. Oh my gosh, that is not pleasant. Favorite hat, check. Glasses, check. Poo mask, check. Let's go to Toys R Us. Let's find, let's buy ourselves a dream. <laughs> Whoa, what is this? Cool. Captive's mega egg. I like this little lenticular eye. That's fun. Selected Jurassic World toys. So I guess this is not on sale. So this guy is 56 with 74. I might as well get another one of these because they're pretty cool. Uh, man, oh, Patasaurus. Oh, I wish I came here like later because I already bought all this stuff. But doesn't hurt to get it on sale. I actually don't have this, so I will grab that as well. I'm so happy I brought a buggy. Preemptively brought myself a buggy. Uh, oh, there's so many little cool ones, but like, it all adds up. It gets pricey. <gasps> what are these? Those are fun. I've never seen these before, but that's a lot. That's like 10 bucks each. Cool. Shringosaurus, Shringalingi, Amber Collection, that is a steal. So this is my whole Jurassic section. I'm definitely grabbing this guy because although he looks like a wrinkly ding dong, I think it'd be really cool to have one of these boxed and one displayed, so. This one's not just a Bryonyx, it's Bryonyx Grim. Bryonyx Grim. It's kind of weird how it's like this different color of green and then this color of green. Are they all like that? Is that other Grim? Yeah, they're all kind of like that. So it's like different color green, different color green. Tie that shelf back up. One for all my Transformers, for all my Transformers fans out there. You guys always get so mad at me when I don't look at the Transformer section, so. I'm just gonna call all these guys whatever I think they're called. Rhino guy. Evil guy. Trucky truck. <laughs> Ooh, that one's fun. 
Battle call. Oh, so does this like light up? It's kind of cool. That is $39. Oh, these are fun. These are like those die cast things, aren't they? Oh, yeah, the heavy die cast metal figures. What's that? What is this for $124? I've never seen these here before. Ghostbusters Muncher. That's cool. Like this little Slimer with Winston. That's cool. I've never seen these here before. Oops. Interesting. Huh. Very cool. But look at these ones. Who are these by? By Hasbro. I wish they had a demon dog, one of those. Oh, yes. Oh. Okay. Okay, I have to get Gozer. That's pretty cool. I love that dog in there. Is it called the demon dog or terror dog? What was it called? Oh, no. Ah, oh, shoot. It's one of those build the things. Oh, okay, that kind of ruined it for me. That kind of ruined it for me. I wish it like came with it. That head sculpt's pretty cool. <gasps> oh. Here's all the Gujitsus. Super jealous of everyone sending me those Jurassic Gujitsus that they keep seeing in their stores. These are so fun though. I actually have the shark one, not this one, like the original shark one that's like super hard and like kind of like the stretch Armstrong because all these are like filled with different things some of them have like beads some of them have goo but like the one I have is like a stretch Armstrong kind big Batman look at all the fun animals they have like you could have these like you have seals you have dinosaurs cats dogs freaking koalas is this a dragon Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Man, kids have like the coolest toys nowadays, eh? Look at this Triceratops. Wow. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, that's so cool. It's like licking the ice cream. Wow, that's amazing. Look at this Harry Potter headwig. Look, and it actually comes with like a little invitation letter from Hogwarts. I just, just like touch the beak. Oh, that's so cute. It reminds me of that owl from uh, Clash of the Titans. It's like, oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 That's so cute. Not really realistically, realistically, not real realistic owl sounds, but that's cute. That's ginormous. Seems a little, it seems a little impractical, but that's pretty interesting. Look at this big G.I. Joe section. I've never seen them have like a big G.I. Joe section before, but here's all the Joes. I like this one with the wolf. That's fun. Snake Eyes is like the only character I know in G.I. Joe. <laughs> so there's these ones. There's these ones. Do, do, do. There's a lot of the Baroness. There's a lot of Baroness, actually. This entire shelf is just Baroness. <laughs> Here's these ones. Yeah! Da-da-da-da-da-da. da 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 Boo Mansion, $49, $46 for this one. Pokemon trivia. What kind of trivia are they gonna ask me? Okay. Who will be the best trainer? Okay. I'm gonna give some facts about the Pokemon universe. It's up to you to guess if they're true 
or false? To answer, press the white part of the Pokeball for true or the red part for false. Okay. May the best win. Okay. Hurry up. Oh my god. True or false? Pikachu has red cheeks. Oh my god. Okay, forget it. True or false? Pokemon starts with P. I guess the questions probably get like harder. Yeah, just like beginner advanced expert. Be interesting to see what the expert questions are. Oh, Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones slowly phasing out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Someone. Uh oh. Someone opened it up. I love these little grunts. I have, I think, two of these guys. They're pretty cool. Wait, what? Oh. <laughs> I thought it came with no head. I was like, what? Down here. That's unfortunate. Ooh, a jackal. That's cool. Giant Shira enamel pin. What are you gonna do with that? That's huge. You're gonna like pin that on your jacket? <laughs> I don't like this guy's face. Okay, time to look at all the Marvel Legends. Oh, Sabretooth, I just got a Sabretooth comic today actually. Very cool. Who thinks that Captain Marvel is going to be here? Who thinks that Captain Marvel is going to be here? And who thinks that she's going to be on sale? Here's all my prices, my prices. Ooh, Tigra. Thor's daddy. Marvel's Frogman. Frogman. And who's this? Oh, it's Captain Marvel. Why are you always on sale, Captain Marvel? Why are you always on sale? Come on. Come on. Come on. Wow, cool. That's a cool figure. 46 buckaroos. Eh. Whoa, there are a lot of, there are so many Marvel Legends figures here. Oh my gosh. This is like so stocked up. Everyone's gonna be like, oh my God. So stocked. What does what does this make? What's that gonna be? Oh. Ew. Here's all the DC figures. Oh look, it's all the King Shark things. So there's his body. I mean, sorry. There's his torso. There's his legs. There's his uh, front and back. And here's his arms. Where's his head? Who has his head? I, I don't know. Don't know who has his head. There's Batman. What a cool display case. How do they, what kind of lights do they have? I like that. Man, they really make these like figures look so expensive just behind this case. It's actually really cool. It's kind of how you display your collectibles, you know? Like you can just get like these 26 to 50 dollar figures and just have them really displayed cool like this and then everyone's like well it looks so expensive but they're like so cheap okay on to oh my brother was telling me about this he saw this figure today dragon 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 ball That's cool. Sell. Eh. Whoa, what is that? Whoa, is this like Bucky O'Hare? Whoa, sweet. Look at this, Star Wars Adventures. Okay, but like, it looks like Bucky O'Hare. 
It's like Bucky O'Hare in real life. How is this not Bucky O'Hare? I don't know anything about this Jackson person. Um, Dracula Transformers? What? They have like the craziest things in right now. Look at that. It's Drac like Dracula robot and it turns into like a robot bat. They have the craziest things in stock right now. I've never seen, never seen such a stocked crazy. These guys are pretty cool. Never seen them so stocked before. Wow. What is this? No clues in there. Jar Jar is still forty-six dollars. Crazy. Ooh, Witcher, only 20 bucks. They should really do another Spawn movie because they need to bring it into like the new age of like craziness. Cool figures. Tom Clancy, Tom Clancy Splinter Cell, goggles, wow. Dang. I don't like this Jack Sparrow. I don't like the smirk on his face. That's sweet. League of Legends, Thresh. I've only played Dota. I've never played League of Legends. But that's a really cool looking character. They have such cool things in right now. And I'm actually so surprised of how many like Marvel Legends are in here and what a big spread there are of them. Man. Bird of Paradise, Plant. International Space Station, Carnage. Oh, look at this. Then Adidas Original, Superstar. Looks like a shoebox, that's pretty cool. Oh, cool, and that's 15. That's pretty sweet and see if those bog ones are in right now. It'd be really cool to get a bog one or two that's on sale for like $49. Regular $69. I need to get one of those things that is just like a mount and it's just like right here that comes out and it's hands free and you can just like twirl it. It's not that, uh, yeah, it's okay. It's kind of busy. Look at the lineups. Lineups outside in some of the stores. That's fun. Like this thing. It's one of those like rides. <laughs> That's fun. I'd love to go to one of those. I'll just go by myself. One, please. And we'll try GameStop. Weird, I thought it was EB Games, but now it's GameStop. We'll try GameStop in a sec. Let's check out Showcase. It's Showcase Store. Showcase. Okay, let's see what they got. Squishy. Attack. Hey, do you guys have Boglins? Boglins? Yes. Oh, there they are. Thank you, thank you. Okay, well. Okay. So we got Bogo Bones, Blobkin, or Crazy Clown. Don't know what one to get. This one kind of looks like it has makeup on that like, and he applied it really bad. I don't really like that. Blobkin. Bogo bones. King Drool. Hmm. Oh man, I don't know. What else do they have here? Funkos. For $16. Pokemons. Have you guys seen those Pokemon Oreos? Where it's like people are selling Mew Oreos, like single Mew Oreos for like hundreds of dollars. Squishy. That's 
cute. It's less work than Odie and Dante, but it's twice as annoying. Okay. EB Games, EB Games, or EB Games. I mean, no, no, it's GameStop. This is GameStop on the front, not EB Games X, like I thought it was. Let's give a hat. Okay. Here's those figures they had in Toys R Us. Oh, cool. What is this? Illuminated terrarium. That's cute. Oh, and is this like a fire escape? Is this like lava? This one? That's cool. Tropical one would be cool of that. Dungeons and Dragons. Look at this giant dragon. Holy crap. That's so cool. Wow. Like this one too. Oh, these are so cool. Wow. Got a lot of Transformers too. Whoa. Too fitty. Too fitty for this big guy. Mini mates. Skelegod. Oh, that's cool. It's like a little Castle Grey skull. It has the little minis inside. It's a cute little display. And I'll give you a peek at this section. Got some pretty cool tools here. Got Hawk Girl. Skeletor. Pokemon, Pokemon. Here's some G.I. Joes. Here's a bunch of Power Ranger stuff. Never seen this stuff before. I have no clue who this is, but I'm liking his sculpt. It's a really fun looking figure. Almost looks like a Thundercats figure. Got this guy already, got the Baron. I took a pass on all the other Dune characters. Oh my gosh. Ace Ventura. Huh. So many of you say that I have like a rubber face, like Ace Ventura when I do all my eyebrow stuff. DC multiverse. More DC figures. Okay, look. Oh, there's a guy. There's a, there's a Jackson guy. He's wearing Bucky O'Hare. There's these guys. Ooh. That's fun. It's a really cool Tuscan Raider figure. I like the cloth on it. Whoa. Turns out all of the EB games in Canada are now officially turning into EB, I mean, sorry, GameStop now. So whenever you see an old EB games, they're like in the process right now of transitioning into official GameStop. Hi, my sweet muffin. I don't know if you like this or you hate it. Give me mixed signals. It's like you like it, but then you don't like it. Ow, ow. Okay. Mom was back home. Mm -hmm. So happy to be back home. It is so like congested out there in the stores. Like there's so many bodies packed into those little stores, like sardines. It's pretty crazy. Um, okay, so I will show you what I got from Toys R Us. You guys already know what I got. Um, I don't have this, so I decided to grab it. There are so many of these T-Rexes out there that it's like kind of really getting overwhelming and it's hard to remember all these things. There's like stomp and chomp, chomp and stomp, strike and chomp. Strikey Stompy, and this one's called Stompin' and Stomp in Escape. Next up, um, you guys know I did buy this already the last time that I went out to Toys R Us, but I wanted to have a second one. There were so many of these in Toys R Us, they really did kind of um, uh, preemptively kind of get everything in stock, hey, for Christmas. They did a really good job. Let me just Thankfully, this guy was on sale. I think he was 69 or something, so, you know, um, it's, it's still a lot of money, but I really, really do want to open one of these um, out of the box. The pumpkin one was just too Halloween-y for me. It was just too too specific Halloween. The crazy clown one was kind of scary to me. It looked like a crazy girl that was doing her makeup and she was like, <laughs> and she was just crazy. It kind of scared me a little bit. Okay, I just noticed this. You see the three, I don't like this. You see the three spikes right here? One, two, three. You see in the middle right here is this giant circle right there. 
And it's essentially just a spike that they cut off and then made it the two spike version because these kings, these king guys right here, whatever, these main guys, they have three spikes. Then these guys have two spikes. That's like really lazy. It looks on the package on the back. It looks like they all have unique sculpts and stuff, but then they go ahead and do that. I really don't like that. Um, then on my way home, I decided to quickly give Facebook Marketplace a little check to see if there's anything cool um, that people were selling, you know, on my route home. So I was so happy I did because there's someone selling all these unicorns and uh, all these unicorn figures, like little small ones and everything for all $5. But there was one that was like a large unicorn and it's a baby unicorn and it looks so realistic and it was only $5. It's very heavy. Look at this little unicorn. Oh, it's a little baby. Isn't that so cute? There's so much detail on it too. Like it's very heavy. Don't you just love its eyes? It's like doll's eyes. Oh, I just love it. It is so cute. I'm gonna put it in my fantasy section. Uh, this is by Living Stone, um, copyright 1984. That's pretty cool. Wow, this is really old. Um, Living Stone, copyright 1984, um, to do San Diego, California. So then I had to go to the post office because I had a package to pick up, um, something that I bought on eBay. And this was kind of like my personal Christmas gift to myself. Christmas time is here. Do, do, do. Oh, sweet. It's like rubbery. I didn't know that. So I ended up getting tendril from the Inhumanoids. Okay, listen, hear me out. Hear me out. Wait, let me move that camera back a little bit. Okay, the thing that sucks about this, everything's in great condition. It's really nice. Nice, like the joints are not super loose like my Metlar. Um, it has like the tail pieces and everything. It's got, you know, it's arms and it's not falling apart. The only thing that sucks is that this is an, an original long fang uh, tendril. So both of the fangs are supposed to be the same size here. Um, but later they cut off both, like they, they made the fang, fang shorter because they said that it was like poking kids or something. It was like a safety issue, I think. Um, so one of my fangs here is broken, but I actually thought it looked pretty cool and normal. Like it actually just looks like, you know, one shorter than the other, who cares? Like it actually looks okay. And I really wanted the original long version. I didn't want to get the shortened version where they're both like this short. I wanted the long ones. To get the big three in Inhumanoids, that's like what everyone really wants to get is the big three. They want Metlar, which is like the demon looking one. There's Tendril, this like plant creature looking one. And then there's Decompose, which is literally like a decomposing body. And it looks really gross. It's got like this big rib cage that opens up and it's got this gross hair strand on its skeletal face. Oh wait, the boys wanted to see you. Come on boys. Hi, Dante. Oh, Danto. Hi, Odi. Spot. It's like a desk right beside my bed and I just put blankets on it and they love looking out the window and seeing all the people that, that go by the house. Okay, Odi. Okay, Odi. Okay, Odi. So that is our little excursion video for today. Um, I'm not too sure when I'll be posting this. As of right now, it is December the 20th. Um, I need to do another, neither. I need to do another PO box video to finish up the PO box stuff. So I will be posting a PO box video next. Um, so if I don't see you guys, you know, before the new year again, um, I wanted to wish you all a very happy new year. So I hope you're all having a safe and happy holiday. So please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I come out with new videos every week. Come check me out on social media and help support the channel on Patreon. So thank you all so much for watching and stay legendary. Bye -bye.